All right, question one, and these are written by Rachel for Roxanne. General knowledge. What movie is currently being reviewed as the highest rated movie ever beating Shawshank Redemption? According to IMDb. All right, the answer, Roxanne, you're going to be kicking yourself, is Dune 2. Whose tour started recently titled Guts? What? This is an, I have no <laughs> idea. Um, it's mm-hmm. Olivia Rodrigo. Uh, <laughs> all right, round two, music. Are you guys ready? Um, in January of 2007, which song from a Ben Gibbard-led band was prominently featured in a national UPS commercial? And I go for it, Rachel. Um, Ben Gibbard's other band. This is a huge hint. Ben Gib- Gibbard's is- other band was Death Cab. The Postal Service? Yes. Okay, number two. Number two, music. <laughs> Who was the... F- this is by Roxanne for Rachel. Who was the first American Idol winner? Oh my God, I know. It was um, Justin. It was Kelly or Justin. I'm going to go Kelly Clarkson. That is correct. It is Kelly Clarkson. It is now one to one. All right. Number three, movies. This is a uh, a fan favorite. And by fans, I mean, it's my favorite. Um, What movie features (laughs) the now infamous line, ask me about my wiener? Accepted. That is correct. It is accepted. Ding, 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 ding. That one was easy, but I mean. Ask me about my wiener. (laughs) What was the first feature length animated movie ever released? Come on, Rachel. Sleeping, no. Snow White, final. That is correct. Snow White. It is number two, two. All right, number four, four. TV. All right, which show did Hugh Grant and Nicole Kidman star in together on HBO? And the answer is The Undoing. All right, TV for Rachel. Are you ready? What did Lucille Balls try to sell in a television commercial on I Love Lucy? It's, uh, <laughs> you want to pronounce that? Vitamita, right, Vitamita Benjamin. Like all the meat, you know, and the memes. No. That's like the biggest because she couldn't say it. Yeah, you guys were mean on that one. That was a mean round. Category five is food, snacks, and or drink. Food, snacks, or drink. Um, Ready, uh, Rox? Yeah. Which brand of drink used to sell a variety of flavored burst drinks with twist-off bottle caps? Santa is incorrect. (laughs) Sorry, it is Kool-Aid. What condiment was used for its medical qualities in the 1800s? And so I'm going to go with ketchup. Final answer? Final answer. Ketchup, ketchup. ketchup is correct. And yes. uh, Roxanne went ahead and left a little factoid here. Uh, in the 1830s, tomato ketchup used to be sold as a medicine claiming to cure ailments like diarrhea, indigestion, and jaundice. <laughs> wow, cure all. Well, thank you, John Cook Bennett, for a delicious condiment. Uh, six, <laughs> dealer's choice. Are you ready, Roxanne? Yes. All right. What was the first American company to reach an evaluation of over $1 trillion? Microsoft. Is it a final answer? Yeah. <clears throat> the correct answer is Apple. You were on the right track. They were... All right, <laughs> dealer's choice. Are you ready, Rachel? Ralph. Luke lost, not me, Luke Skywalker, lost which of his hands in a fight with Darth Vader? I have both hands. Oh my god. His right hand. Final fi- answer. Final answer. That is correct. <laughs> Literally. Oh, All right. You guys ready? To Okay, so seven is a is a specialty round for this podcast. Do you want to explain what it is, girls? So our seventh round is going to be deconstructed. Basically, we are describing something to the other player or our host is, and the least amount of clues you get, the more points you get. So this could be some way of one of us coming from behind. So Luke, go for it. All right, Rachel, you ready? No, wait, just kidding. Roxanne, are you ready? Yeah. The first piece of the puzzle (laughs) is a soul. A soul? Like, can you spell that for me? I cannot spell it for you. A soul. The shoe. Final answer? Yeah. It is shoes. (laughs) The main material contents of these are metal, Glass and inert gas. I'm not gonna answer yet, though. Okay, next clue. You want your second clue, Rachel? Yes, please. Alessandro Volta, Humphrey Davy, and Joseph Swan played a critical role in the development of this technology. That's a mean clue, Roxanne. I was like, that doesn't help at all. This is for your one point clue. Yeah, 
There are three main types. Incandescent. Included. It's a light bulb. It's yeah. a freaking light bulb. <laughs> it's a light bulb. Fluorescent and light emitting diodes, LEDs. Oh my god, I knew it was a light bulb. I, I should have just smart. gone with my gut. You're so smart. <laughs> is it is that your final answer? Yeah, it's final answer. It's not a light bulb. Is this? Yeah, it's a light bulb. Hi. A tie. All right, tie tiebreaker question for both of you. I'm gonna look up a tiebreaker question. Okay. How long in meters was the Titanic? And please uh write down write it down on a piece of paper and then read it out so loud we can't or write change down your phone. It. How long in meters was the Titanic? Okay. Okay. Uh, we'll go Roxanne. Nineteen hundred. Nineteen hundred. Oh my god! There's that no way. Is the largest ship on Earth. <laughs> There's no way. That I was like, that's a way too big. A beast. Think. All right. <laughs> oh yeah, you're right. It's Ra- a few miles. <laughs> I I don't think I think you're gonna win this one, Rachel. What is it? <laughs> I mean, I thought I put a lot. I put three hundred and twelve. That was much closer. The answer is 269 yeah. meters. Oh, I was like very close. Yes. All right. So <clears throat> congratulations to Rachel for winning the first ever episode of Broke, Broke and Brilliant. Brilliant. <laughs>